25th of June, Thursday. Welcome to the update from the recovery room. Beautiful day here again. Trust you guys well. And uh, a two-part two -part video today. Just a couple of points. And this struck me. I did a video a couple of days ago. And uh, some people, most people, they click or they like and make a comment. And it's all good fun. And the videos are there just for, you know, it keeps me alive if nothing else. And somebody came back on a post. doesn't matter who it is or where they were. And he said, um, it, the headline was feedback for you. I've got some feedback for you about your video. Now, if anybody gives you feedback, anybody who's been on stage or does a presentation or workshop, you, you know this. If anybody wants to give you positive feedback, they just give you positive feedback. That was great. Thanks very much. You're, you know, you're whatever. You're a genius. All good. If somebody somebody says to you, is it okay if I give you some feedback? It's not going to be good, is it? It's going to be something different. So anyway, when this I saw the headline, I was like, oh, what have I done? And he just came back and he said, uh, uh, some feedback for your video. Uh, I didn't even watch it. I didn't even watch your video because it looked like a sales video. I don't watch sales videos, therefore I scrolled by it. Just so you know, I thought you'd be interested in my feedback. And I thought, no, I'm not interested in your feedback because it must have taken him longer to write the post to tell, to tell me that he didn't watch the video because he was too salesy than he would have done to watch the video and figure out that it wasn't salesy. Anyway, so I went back and I, I just, I just learned my lesson. I just said, what what, what made you think that it was a sales video? Because I was genuinely interested. These aren't sales videos. I don't think they are. I said, what gave you the idea that it was a sales video? Just so I can you know, figure out what not to do and, and trigger him again. Anyway, and he came back and he said, uh, I've already told you. I thought I made it clear that it was the, the text. Anyway, so I just blocked and deleted him. Uh, anyway, imagine being married to him. My goodness. But there's a lot of people out there when you do these posts and videos and content that are doing this sort of passive aggressive, whatever it is, and they don't like it. I don't, they just, they, not that they, they just want to tell you they don't like you. And it's okay they don't like me, but you know, don't like me from a distance. Don't tell me about it. So you're going to get this. You're going to get these somewhat strange people. And uh, he's, he's blocked now. He's blocked. Hopefully he's gone back to his, his, his cabin and calmed down or whatever it is. So he, I don't know him. He's not even connected with me in a different country. I have no idea who he is, but clearly me doing a video about stuff uh, triggered him. So don't do that. Don't be that guy. Don't be him. Anyway. Uh, next point is um, the word passion seems to be used a lot in people's marketing now, that people are passionate about things and passionate for this and passionate for that. And uh, I think it's been overdone a little bit because I see on sort of LinkedIn here people who are passionate about industrial adhesives or passionate about balance sheets or passionate about packaging solutions. Now, I've been in the packaging industry. I have a, I have a certificate in packaging. <laughs> there you go. I've actually qualified and I won an award in the packaging industry. So I know a little bit about packaging and uh, I enjoyed it. I wasn't passionate about it. They look at it passionate about a cardboard box. Um, what, the reason for that is I think it's overdone. It's one of those things overdone. One of the, 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 the filters through which I put people when I either work with them or we hire them or you know we collaborate or whatever it is, or even as clients, to be fair, one of the filters is, would I get out in the pub with them for a drink? You know, are they sort of people I want to hang out with? Are they my sort? Do we, do we fit? You know, is there sort of a, a, a balance there? And to me, would I go to the pub? And they, if anybody's got this on their profile, my apologies. It's not directed at anybody individually, as much as a well disclaimer. But if anybody's passionate about um, you know, industrial adhesives, I'm not sure we're going to have a fabulous conversation at the pub. I've got different passions in my life I can talk about. I do enjoy what I do. Um, but I'm not passionate about adhesive. So if you're going to put the word passionate onto your profile or for your marketing, uh, be, be slightly careful with it. Um, yeah, we, I think everybody who owns their own business uh, must have a passion for it to a degree because it's what we do, we love what we do, and it's, it's who we are as well. But um, not industrial adhesives, not, not, not commercial packaging. I don't think there's a passionate thing about packaging. But there you go, just me. So um, have a great week. Don't do the passive-aggressive. If you don't like my videos... Well, if you don't like them, watch them and then just go and do something else. Um, you don't need to tell me you don't like them. It's absolutely fine. It's just a sort of stranger in the room, psycho in the bar. Anyway, have a great day. That's my little, it's not a rant, it's an observation. It's an observation for the day. So have a great day. I'll catch you tomorrow on what which is Friday. And uh, we're doing the wine tasting quiz night tomorrow night, Friday. If you want to jump on that. 
ping me a message. It's good fun. And we have a bit of a wrap up to the week. And next week, we've got the workshop starting. So not a sales pitch, not a sales pitch, only clients allowed. So you can't come on it anyway. But if you're one of the clients, you want to come on that, just ping me a message. I'll uh, drop you the invite. So have a great day. Don't be passive aggressive. And don't be passionate about <laughs> industrial adhesives. There's more to life than industrial adhesives. But there you go. Just me. Have a great day. I'll see you tomorrow.